Annalie and Jesse Thursday activate. Today is Thursday. We have the day off. Anna, well, you technically have to work. You have the day off every day. Thanks, Anna. <laughs> it's true. I am. I just tag along for fun. Um, Anna works tomorrow at like 5 a.m. Mm -hmm. I believe. So we have the full day off. So we're gonna head to Tokyo today. Not really sure what we're doing, but it is hot again. Oh my I lord. Yesterday. Yeah. Feel it. We're in the shade, silly. Uh, how was your show last night? Awesome. I'm so proud of it. Yeah. Is it like five haircuts in like a span of like? No way. It was so funny, like there was just like some of them I went really quick and some of them I went really slow. Yeah. But it normally at like at the salon I'm timed out like an hour to an hour and fifteen minutes. That's with a cut and a bow tie in style. Yeah. And like I was like apologizing right now, I'm a little slow. <laughs> and I'm like, how long does it take some of because not all of them are they're more makeup artists and hairstylists. Yeah. So that's why it takes a little bit it's a little more difficult training them. Yeah. You're um, talking about the other styles that you train here in Japan. Yeah, most of the people that work on set here, they have to do both. They're, they're makeup artists and hairstylists, um, but more focused on makeup. Mm -hmm. So the hair part is like secondary, so it's a little bit harder to like train. Because like, you know, it's hair. But then there's some hair that are, uh, are some new styles that we have that are actually hair people. Yeah. They work at hair salons. Nice. It's a little bit easier. So I was asking them, like, oh, how long does it take for you guys? You know, how, how what's your timing on haircuts here and whatever. And you know, everyone's different. But she's like, oh, like half an hour. I was like, wait, is that cut and blow dry? I'm like, yeah. mine takes like an hour and 15 minutes. Yeah. You know? What did she say? She, I don't think it was like lost in translation. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know? All I know is that it was just like an hour and 15 and I yeah. was just laughing at myself. But, you know, yeah. Maybe you just do more detailed haircuts in the States than they do in Japan. All right, before we get on the train to Tokyo, it takes about an hour, we're gonna eat. Look at this beer I got, it's called Small Glass Beer. <laughs> Only in Japan. Actually, I should drink it like this. Apparently, I'm only eating tiny things today. I don't know why. Tiny beer, <laughs> tiny food, for the tiny man. <laughs> Thanks, Santa. <laughs> so that's, that, that's a potato croquette. <laughs> that is a. Oh no, that's a katsu. This is a croquette, and there's a shrimp back there. Pretty funny. I'm not sure what this stuff is. A little soup. And then I got her katsu. Don't laugh at me. Hey guys, we successfully navigated to the west exit of Shinjuku Station. If you've ever tried to do that, it's fucking impossible. Now we're checking out the massive amount of vending machines here, and we just noticed something that a lot of them had English writing on them. See? Nice. <laughs> Alright, so we just were in map camera. I didn't record any video in there because I know they're weird about it, but we got some film, Raleigh film? I have never even knew that existed. Huh? Yes. How hipster bullshit camera is that? <laughs> so you go like this, lens comes out, you turn it, and that is the camera there. Now the cool thing about this is it has a Tessar 40 millimeter lens on it, which is just basically like a Zeiss, Carl Zeiss, Leica kind of esque lens. Just stuck on a very tiny little film box. Look how tiny it is. For comparison, Anna's hand. It's smaller than the G7X that we're filming this on right now. I actually got it for Anna because she wanted to use a film camera. So it's for us to share. But yeah, we got it from Map Camera, which is a, such a cool store if you get a chance to go see it in Shinjuku. Yes. Okay, now we're gonna go play claw games in here. Oh, do I see a sleeping Pikachu? We're looking for this thing I saw on the Japanese website, news website. It's a gacha thing. These things right here, I'll show you in a second. It's basically hats for dogs. Are you ready? There it goes. Oh, Which did you get? Yeah. 
Camo hat. Who's that? Oh my god, it's for Thor. Let's go get it more. <laughs> oh my god. Let's get another one. Another one, yeah. one more. <laughs> oh yes. Oh my god. Why couldn't you give me pink, guys? But these are good. That's so funny. Yeah. Uh, thanks to Anna for finding that. I pointed it out to her earlier and I'm like, I see dogs wearing hats. I didn't get what you were Keep an eye on. I, I it's I kind of it a, like a It's kind of an odd thing, I know. But I'm like, you're going to love it when you find it. I so. do. All right, we're going to the Starbucks to pee. Do you want a crushed orange? Thank you. All right, so we're about to try the new drink from Starbucks, which is like orange crush or something. You first. There's oranges in there. It better be good because it's nine minutes. Uh, six bucks. That's a little thing. Yeah. Ready? You try first. No, first. Is it like an orange stevia? Has chunks of orange in it. Is it a good thing? Um, you try it. I like it. You like it? I don't know. It's a little weird. It's tart for you and it looks too sour. It's kind of like an orange juice with the chunks. The chunks yeah. are kind of weird to me. I think if you get the bottom, the bottom is like more of a bitter orange. The middle is more like sweet. Yeah, I'm just going to pull the top. Yeah. I give it a B. Right. Let's see if Jesse's doing this right. Of course, he did watch a YouTube video. Yeah. Oh, and we just went away to see if it, how to do it. Got it. Yes, you did it. Does it have like the counter? Yep. So focus. What are you doing? I'm trying to figure out the Sunny F16 rule for exposure. Because this has a meter, but it needs a battery. Uh, what are you doing? My nose, you're saying. Okay. It always looks weird when I'm doing this. Yeah. It's like I'm picking my nose up. If my nose is all the way by my nose, I guess it's the camera. Oh, but anyway, so you basically have to use the exposure meter in your head. How about that? So we are here. That's actually a really good sign. Are you excited, Anna? I'm not sure yet. I like the cloud. So iPhone has a light meter, right? You have to buy an app. Yeah. All right, guys, you ready? This is this is slow photography. That, that, and then that's about 20 feet away from me, so that's the focus there. Um, Picture taken. All right, let's go. What is it? They're painting this building and it stinks. Down here? That way then go here? I don't know. It's so confusing. Commit to one. Commit to a grid? Yeah. Walk around and like back and forth. That's the plan then. And don't forget to look up too. <laughs> There's shops up down, up and down too. Box latte. Oh, she found her dream.
So we're in Shimo Kitazawa, and the people here on bikes are ruthless. It's like they don't want to accept the fact that there's a lot of people walking around. They just like straight up run you over with their bike. It's a little bit funny. Cool place, lots of vintage stores, and lots of scarves for Anna to get. Her scarf oh, no. collection. Oh my god. Oh my god, three for nine bucks. Wow. How cool, look at this place, guys. Wow. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. Yum. Do you want to go to Florida? I don't know if I want to go to Florida. They have Zika. Oh, yeah. We better not go to Florida. <laughs> Too far, anyway. I can't deal with this place. It's overwhelming. Oh, wow. Look at this. I think I found my new shop. Haircuts. Dude. Oh, yeah. French fries. These are probably Canadians. They're attracted to French fries. All right, check out how the burgers just came. It's pretty funny. All right, spin. That's my butter chicken burger. You're going so fast. Those are my onion rings. Go. There's Anna's burger. Wow, that looks good. Go. Wow.